Yeah, I look like a Shrider rider, but I go everywhere. You know what? <laughs> I, that, you're a true rider. You're riding that and getting out. That's awesome. While Vancouver Island has a population of 800,000 people, much of it is like this. As you can see from the Cougar Habitat suitability map, most of the human population is located in a narrow purple band running from the southeast to the mideast of the island, where cougars are not particularly welcome and deer have it easy. Meaning that much of the rest of the island is sparsely populated by humans. Riding in the forests, mountains and bush of Vancouver Island can be an exciting, perhaps risky and sometimes lonely experience. It's easy to get lost, stuck or worse injured. That's why coming across fellow riders is an excuse to stop and talk. And while many enduro riders are drawn to the solitude and tranquility of the wilds, it's always refreshing, comforting and sometimes necessary to stop, chat and share trail information as trails and the conditions are always changing. This video is about that. If I remember rightly, it's about 42 clicks. Wow, that is a beauty. Whoa. Gotta keep your eyes on what you're doing here. That will help me turn and take a look. Yes, that's beautiful. No, if I passed it, this is the Englishman River here. I cannot have passed it already. Surely not. Very nice. Just have to get out. Yeah. Do you go everywhere on the trail? What's that? Do you go everywhere on the trail? Yeah. It's beautiful. I my big bike and I think that more fun on this than my 650. What, what, what 650 have you got? I had a XR 650. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. One. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, Christ, I almost was up at Moherty Lake and I was at Marshall Lake. Just today? I was going to Moriarty Lake and I missed the turn off. <laughs> yeah, you can't get there. The snow, about the last kilometer, I parked it in the snow as far as oh. I could make it. Oh, that's too bad. Well, I'm going to go up there and have a look anyway. You can go right on up to the lake down as well. Like I said, though, you'll make it to a really good view. Then you hit snow. The oh, yeah. Just before, probably a kilometer, but almost to the last turn off to get to the lake. Then used to be able to sneak up and over. Yeah. Yeah. It's been a long time. I beat the little girl today pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I started late, so I'm going to go late. Yeah, I started early morning. Yeah. I, but, well, I got, I got to phone my mum. She's in England, right? If I don't phone her every Sunday, I'm in uh, trouble. God, is this the last time we're going to see this? Oh, <laughs> uh, I hope not. Me too. Yeah. Well, um... Enjoy your day. Sounds good. Love well, have a great day. I'm very impressed. Yeah, I look like a Shrider rider, but I go everywhere. You know what? I, that, you're a true rider. You're riding that and getting out. That's awesome. Yeah. 58. Yeah. You got to. See you later. Guy out on a on a Honda 90. Awesome job. That'll be me. Loved his little reserve gas can on the back there. Wow, look at that. Hiya. How you doing? You don't know where the road to Moriarty is, do you? The road to where? To, to Moriarty. No? Oh, okay. Oh, you're not getting to the highway here. Um, I mean, if you, if yeah, the snow will stop you. Okay. The snow will stop you. Okay, so you gotta go up and there's gonna be. You're gonna, you're gonna go up in any of the little trails that you take. You'll get to Englishman River. You can cross the bridge, um, and you can go up towards uh, Mount Ar Mount uh, Arrowsmith. Uh, but you'll, you'll run into snow before you get there. I don't come in through the gates, so yeah, I live right on the trail. Uh, oh, it's the rally. I didn't recognize it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. What do you think? Good. I got uh, 13,000 kilometers on it. Have you come from a dirt bike background or, or a street bike? Both. Oh, cool. But I haven't had a bike for 30 years, so. It's nice to see other people out here, actually. Yeah, well, according to the map, it shows you can probably. Uh... <sighs> 
the showing you can go all the way, like you said, Mount Aerosmith and all that, so you're probably going to get into all that snow. Yeah, there's a lot of old trails there, some of it might not be possible. I'd be shocked, but you never know, things could have changed. I haven't been out for 18 months or so, so... So, as I said, you'll come along here and you'll see a crossing right here. over the bridge, yeah. And, does uh, that road take you all the way back? This one is one where I'm going to take you all the way back, yeah. This is 155. No, but I mean on the other side of the bridge. Oh, good question. It good used question, to. Eh? It used to. Whether it's blocked off, whether it's in disuse, I don't know. You could try it. It's a straight shot. It's fairly simple. Yeah. <clears throat> How long have you been riding? Uh, since I was uh, 16, so I'm yeah. quite old now, so... Uh, I've got all sorts of bikes. I've got two road bikes and uh, the Hooserberg here, which I love. Oh, we're supposed to be heading back to Nanaimo Lakes and that, Fourth Lake and that, but uh, you know, they close the gate at 4 o'clock yeah. on a weekend. So. Ah, oh, hang on. Just a minute. Let me just shrink that down. Oh, here we are. This is what it's just over here. Here it is. This is the turn. I went past and I went up this guy. So you got to go up this one. Yeah, I've got to go back. Just another few yards, and then I can head up here. That's it. Yes, 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 yes. I always go equipped. Usually I go in the back country. I have all my little propane and everything, and axe and everything. Today oh. I was just heading on the highway, and I said, well... Yeah, let's try it. Why don't you try this road? Oh, well. I wish you luck. I'm going to zip oh, up. Too? I see you got the... Uh, all the cameras. Oh, I've got cameras, I've got a drone in here. I can't fly the drone in the rain. I was flying, it was following me. It's a following me drone, so it follows me where I go. Right. Um, with a uh, long story short, this is the second one I've had because the first one flew itself into a lake. It was a bit of a wrangle with the company to get them to cough it up, I'll tell yeah. you. I got an adapter, I got a backup battery. Oh, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got a little power pack that I carry in here and good for 20 hours. Oh, that's good. So yeah. I always go prepared. Yeah. Yeah, I've got, I've got things like saws and all sorts of things. I took all my survival stuff out of here to get the drone in, so, <laughs> so I'm not going to stay, uh, stay too late, that's for sure. I'm just going to head there before they close the gate. But... Yeah. Okay. okay. Have a good one. So how about you? Oh, we've been enjoying it. We've been all around from, yep, from the back side of, uh, I guess the cliff side of uh, Boomerang and that kind of thing, kidney and all that. Oh yeah. And then, yeah, yeah, you do the tour thing. Say so again? You did the tour uh, online. You, online tour? Your buddy did the tour thing. I forget what it's called. Yeah, the Real Motorcycle Diaries. Yeah, that's oh, right. cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, it's just up at Moriarty actually. Moriarty? Say again? I met you at Kidney Lake. I think I remember you. Yeah. yeah. Uh, he's uh, he's moved to Gabriella Island. Moriarty, you went to though. Yeah. Really, no snow or a few patches or. Uh, right at the end. Yeah. Uh, just as you, just before you get to the lake to look down, the snow's about eight nine inches. <laughs> yeah, cool. But you can get up there. So did you go? You did you go the main line way? Like so, you went to like all the way to uh, follow Englishman River until you're just about you, the bridge, and then your next left. No, ten, you're ten. Up, you, you're 10 clicks before the bridge. Oh. Yeah, yeah, so 10 clicks before the bridge. Yep. Take a left up uh, 1556. Oh. I took a picture of it because it's fading, the sign's fading now, yeah, six yeah, something. Yeah, 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 and it's a little more... Uh, it's a beautiful road, oh yeah. my god. You go, it, it, looks, it looks not great for the first bit, and then when you finally, after about six, seven, eight clicks, you pop out and you ride along the valley. Wasn't there like a big tree in the way there that guys had cut now, now it's wider? You used to have to... No, okay, different no, way. No, no, no. Oh, 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 ha, ha. 
So Here when you are. get when you get right to the other end, yeah, yeah. Well, that's uh, you, it's wider now. You can get past that now. Cool. Yeah. So they they uh, I guess I they do know the trail. Good, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Interesting. Uh, I haven't been up there in years. It's been years. Yeah, it's got to be five years. Oh yeah. Yeah. Wow. So, no, like that. Because so we went down that trail on a quads to the cabin. Is that still possible? It was pretty gnarly. Uh, you can do it on a bike. I, I didn't go down today, so yeah. I just I just fought with the snow for a bit, and then uh, then I thought I was going to go. Worth, it's not worth the energy when you just walk down there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, uh, but to, I got oh, probably a year ago. I was in and out of there, no problem on the yeah, bike. So when I was doing it, it was a long time ago, and it was probably a lot smoother, you know. Yeah, than they've where made it is now. they've made a little path around it. Okay. You know, the the buggers drop the logs to stop you connecting up with the fourth lake, right, and all that yeah, stuff, I right? So. But now you can uh, you can go past the the lake, so don't go down to Moriarty. Carry on round to the right, okay. towards Mount Moriarty, right yep. in front of you, yep. and right up at the top there, um, you can connect through to Labor Day. Oh yes, yeah. I am familiar with that. Yeah, yeah, Echo, yeah. Panther Echo and Labor Day. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. I do know the area now. Oh, that's good to know. Yeah, yeah. So those will tie in. Yeah, yeah. 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 And I mean, they try to block it off, so if you've got a chainsaw with you, you won't have any trouble. They. <laughs> They do oh, a crap nice job. Bike you got there. Yeah, this is great. I love this thing, but uh, ah, well, good luck on the rest of the day. Thank you. Yeah, you well, it's ne nearly over now. Yeah, I know. We do. We're doing one more little, just one more little tour up at uh, the viewpoint, and then uh, yeah. Sounds good. All right. Yeah, you too. Have a good one. So three very different conversations with three very interesting individuals. One on a Honda Trail 90 who had been over 80 kilometers at certain points on his journey away from the nearest civilization. A lot of valuable information is shared about trails and conditions as there are no accurate maps of the trails out here. Many trails are years old, decommissioned and subject to slides or washouts and tree falls. So swapping information is the only way we can get an accurate picture of the viability of a trail or a connector. And touching base with the last group was amazing. I've only run into them once before, many years ago, yet they remembered because coming across other riders can be a rare event out here. I hope you enjoyed that insight into riding the trails on Vancouver Island, Canada. Once again, thanks for watching everyone. If this is the first time you've watched, please consider subscribing. I do motorcycle reviews, motorcycle-related product reviews, off-road and on-road vlogs as well as tours. Even though I'm not the most diligent poster, don't forget to follow me on social media. That's Instagram, Facebook and Twitter. And to like, and especially, I'm begging you here folks, subscribe. And don't forget to click the bell so that you're notified whenever I release a video. This is the Blue Marble Rider, out.